study this equation a moment. Let's decide how to begin solving. We have no fractions, no parentheses. Do we have any like terms on either side of the equation? The answer is yes. These two terms are like terms. 4z minus z or 4z minus 1z, that's 3z, plus 1 is equal to 1 plus z. Now let's move variable terms to one side, numbers or constants to the other side. I'll subtract z from both sides. So here's my left side, I'll subtract z. Here's my right side, I'll also subtract z. On the left side, 3z minus z, that's 2z plus 1 is equal to 1. And now let's subtract 1 from both sides. Now be very, very careful. Here's my left side, I'm subtracting 1. Here's my right side, I'm subtracting 1. The left side simplifies to 2z. The right side, 1 minus 1, is 0. That's fine. 0 is a good real number. How do I finish solving for z? Just as usual, we'll divide both sides by the coefficient of z, which is 2. So the left side becomes z. The right side, what is 0 divided by 2? 0 divided by 2 is 0. So this equation does have a solution. The solution is 0. You can check by replacing z with 0 here, here, and here and seeing that a true statement results.